Hey YouTube, what's up? It's iPod Mod Tutorials here, and today I'm going to teach you guys how to jailbreak any A5 device, meaning the iPhone 4S and iPad 2 only, on iOS 5.0 and 5.0.1. So, what you're going to use is this new program called Absinthe that many i i device hackers have just recently put out for windows and but there will be a link for windows and mac in the description and for windows and mac it'll be the same exact process so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to download the program and extract it to your desktop like like this and if you're on windows what you're going to want to do is right click the program and press run as administrator <clears throat> and then press yes and make sure that your iPhone or iPad, I'm using my iPhone 4S, is plugged in. <clears throat> it's it's one of the very it's one of the simplest jailbreaks there is. Once just make sure that your iDevice is plugged in. Oh sorry. Just make sure it's plugged in and press jailbreak. You don't even have to put it in the DFU mode or anything. And as you can see, it's beginning the jailbreak. And it will, like it says, it will appear as it's is restoring your iPod, but, but it's not. It's <clears throat> it's just it's adding all the files to it. And do not unplug your i i device at all during the jailbreak process, or else it is likely to give you an error. <clears throat> and as I said before, there will be a link to both in the description. And I'm not going to cut anything out of this video so I can show you guys the full entire jailbreak. And for some of you guys, it, it might not work on the, uh, on the first try. That's okay. It, it just just retry it again. Uh, and it should work. <clears throat> and it, as I said, as I mentioned when I first started this video, it's only for A5 devices, meaning the iPhone 4S or iPad 2. It will not work on any other device. Do not, even, like when your iPod comes up to the screen, don't press anything, just let your iPod sit or else it'll give you an error message. Yes, yeah, as, it, as it says, do not touch your device yet. <clears throat> and you guys can check out my other videos and I'm going to be making more videos on t tutorials and cool tweaks and hacks for the iPhones. Okay. Now, once it says almost done, just unlock the screen if necessary, then tap the jailbreak icon to finish. What you're going to want to do is you're going to open up your iPhone or your i or your, or your iPad. Slide to unlock. You're going to go over and you'll see that you have the absinthe icon. What you want to do is open it up. <clears throat> and it's going to say Ab absence is now setting things up please stand by and if you don't get this screen and you get an error message what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to go into uh, your settings application and then there'll be a new toggle as soon as you look at it called VPN and you're gonna switch it and it's gonna give you an error message and when the error message comes up don't press cancel just let the error message sit there for five seconds and it'll automatically reboot your device like so like mine just happened and you will get uh, it'll reboot and then once it loads up Cydia will replace the absence the absinthe icon and your I iPhone 4s or iPad 2 will be jailbroken <clears throat> and once your iPhone 4s is jailbroken I would suggest doing a backup so, <clears throat> so that just in case anything happens you don't lose any of your files <clears throat> and this is untethered as you can read, it meaning every time that you turn on your iPhone, you will not have to uh, boot it up using a third-party program on your computer. Okay, and my iPhone 4S has booted up. Slide to unlock, and as you can see, Cydia is now installed on your iPhone 4S or iPad. And all you're going to want to do is let Cydia load. It's preparing the file system. It says Cydia will exit when complete. And this can take maybe a minute or two, sometimes three minutes, so I'll be right back when this is done loading. 
all right guys it's it's been loaded up it uh, probably was about 30 seconds after I left and you're all set up and you just want to go slide and open up Cydia and you might want to be connected to Wi-Fi if you're doing this so that it doesn't go as slow I'm gonna choose developer like if you've been jailbroken before and you know how to use it and what things to install I would suggest doing developer because it knows like it it doesn't leave out any of the packages that it lets you install but if this is your first time I would press user so I'm gonna press developer and as you can see you have Cydia loaded up and just to prove this is my iPhone 4s on my iPhone 4s on 5.0.1 on Cydia 1.1.4 so thanks guys for watching and have a great day and you are jailbroken on your A5 device using Absinthe Thanks, guys, for watching. Have a great day.